Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves at a traffic stop where a more soft heart tries to pull out all the tricks in the book to get out of some tickets, but it fails and he still ends up with a pile of tickets. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. They not honoring my bay name, right? So cool. I dipped out. I said, I'm not even going to worry about going to school because if they don't want me to put my nationality on the record, it's obvious that they want to try to steal from me and stuff like that. You get what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, I get what you're saying. You don't want that edumacation and because you don't want your uh, more sovereign citizen beliefs challenged, which is a sign of a very weak-minded individual. I do believe that sums it up right there, dude, but let's continue on. Hold on, y'all. So now I got a policy enforcer behind me. Oh, boy. I bet that law enforcement officer, not policy enforcer, must have noticed that you had no plates or bad plates like all you sovereign citizen Morse types like to have on your vehicle. But let's see how you are able to talk your way out of this one, if you can. How you doing? What's your, what's your name? Don't start this again. Open the, open the window, please. I need, I need a license registration. For what? Well, now, this is a change. We have an officer that doesn't exactly want to play these more soft-hard games. This should be short, sweet, and to the point. Wonderful. We don't have to listen to 30 minutes of sovereign citizen nonsense. Let's see what we get out of it, so. License and registration. I just stopped y'all. Explain to you as soon as I get your license and registration. Every time we deal with you, I'm not you get a problem. Listen. Every time. I'm open your window or give me your license and registration, okay? Stop your nonsense. Every time we deal with you, you're a problem. Huh, I wonder if this officer has pulled this uh, particular more soft tart over once or twice or maybe a dozen times before. Who knows? But he seems like he has dealt with them. I don't know why you. Don't I don't know you. Know why you don't make it easy? I know exactly who you did are. Did I break any laws? Royal crest. Yes, you did. What the, license and registration. No, am I being You're a detained? You're gonna be arrested in a second if you don't give me your license and registration. Where's the injured party? It's a traffic violation, you damn fool. Sometimes there isn't an injured party. It just depends on what type it is, as far as that goes. Like speed limit issues, no tag, insurance, or anything like that dude which means in the case of insurance there's a potential for a problem where you could uh potentially injure somebody and not have the insurance to uh help them out i mean it's just prevention at this point dude license and registration for what all right i'm gonna give you my license and registration you are gonna because you're, you're required to by law no i'm not yes you are no i'm not and having a driver's license is a privilege okay yeah, and I, I'm not driving, I'm traveling. Well, you're partially correct, dude. You are traveling, but you are using a method of traveling called driving, and it's normally associated with an automobile, a vehicle, a car, truck, SUV, bus, whatever. But you are certainly operating that m m motor vehicle, so therefore you are most certainly driving, and you are required by law to have license, insurance, and registration. So you need to really check up on your particular state's laws and understand them a lot better. Okay, all right, listen. So why do why do I need to show you a driver's license? Registration. I'll be happy to explain you why I stopped you. If you were following all the, the rules of the road, I wouldn't have to be stopping you right now. I am following the... Okay, I'm not, there's no stopped. such thing as I'll rules of the road. There are no rules of the road? Dude, are you stupid or just delusional? I am willing to bet both at this point because you seem like the type that could handle both being stupid and delusional. As soon as you give me your license and registration. 
I don't have no license and registration. You're required to give me your license and registration. I don't have no license and registration. You do. You're just about so to get can it. I have your name and first, last name and bond? I need your license and registration and you'll have my name. I need three three um, you know, identifications you know from I'm you. I'm the one who arrested you for the, uh, the marijuana that you ended up in court for. You didn't arrest me. Okay. No, right. you didn't. Okay. I need three forms of identification. Why, can I have three forms of identification? License and registration. I don't know who you are. You've seen these videos on TV, don't you, where the windows get busted out because they don't provide I don't know who you are. I'm not doing anything wrong. License and registration. Can you tell me? You, what, are what, you are required to provide me with license What did I do? When you get pulled over. I'll explain to you as soon as I see your license right. registration. I'm going to give you this because I don't want to have any issues or have you because you're already being aggressive and I'm afraid you're, for my life. You're already being difficult. I'm, I'm afraid for my life because you're oh, saying okay. that you know yeah, me. And wife. if you know me, that means you came to my house and harassed me before, right? I harassed. Okay, listen, I need a license registration. He probably knows you because you pull all this... Uh, Sovereign citizen crap every time you get pulled over because you have no plates or anything like that. And so, therefore, you're easier to recognize because you're one of the few people that actually do it around him. So, it could be that. Explain to why I stopped you. Where's, where's the registration? I don't have no registration. This is not, I'm traveling. I need your regis vehicle registration. I don't have no registration. This is not my vehicle. I'm not in a vehicle. I'm traveling oh, man, freely. I don't know why you gotta be like this every time. It's ridiculous. I'm a Moorish American. I've never met anybody like you in my entire life. I am a Moorish American. That per that on that identification is not me. I'm a national. That's a birth that's used for commerce. Why you do this? That's not identification. I am Devon Bay. I'm not that whoever that says on that you social. Too much internet and you and TV. Nah. You're, you're trying to, I don't know what you're trying to do, but I'm not going to let you, when I'm not you even going to. When did you become a sovereign citizen? I'm not a sovereign citizen. I'm a Moorish American. I'm not a sovereign citizen. Uh, let me, let me, let me level. I'm a national. Let me level with you here. So can you speak to me like an adult? I'm sorry, officer, but I think it'd be impossible for him to behave like an adult because while it looks like he has the body of a grown man, it appears that he has the mental stability of a first grader. And even then, that is uh, grossly over exaggerating his mental capacity. Like what? What? Why do you do this every time? What am I doing? You're, you're being difficult. I'm traveling freely, and you stopped me for no reason. When you, no, I didn't stop you for no reason. Why do you think I stopped you? Why? Can I tell Why me? do you think? Why? Why do you think? I don't know. You have no idea? Nope. Because when I was sitting back there, you went by me with your phone in your hand, just like this, driving right past me. So that's a crime? Yes, you're not allowed to have your phone anywhere in, any, in your hand. I'm Okay. Portable electronic device. I'll let you do what you got to do, and portable, I'll do it. Portable electronic I'll device. let you do I'm not driving. I'm traveling. So go ahead and do what you got to do, and I'll do what I got to do. If you did what you had to do, then you wouldn't be sitting at this traffic stop waiting for tickets or waiting to be arrested. You would actually have an insured car, a tagged car, and an actual driver's license, and uh, never have been pulled over to begin with unless you were speeding or anything else that was a traffic violation. But is, is that too complicated for you, or do you need some more explanation on how not to get pulled over by the police? You know, that night at your house, I tried to have a heart-to-heart -heart with you when I got you out of the car and said, I don't know why you just... I mean, you can make it so much easier if you just act like an adult and talk to people like an adult and don't give people a hard time right off the bat. I don't know why you always do this. It doesn't, it just doesn't make anybody want to give you a break if you act like that every time you deal with the police, man. I don't understand what the problem is. Can I have your surety bond and three forms of identification, please? My name is on here as well as the police department I work for. Can I have your surety bond number? I don't know what that is. Do you have a delegation order of authority? I don't know what that is either. Okay. You for portable electronic device, okay? The delegation of authority is not a thing. Neither are those bonds that you mentioned, dude. So pull your head out of your ass, get out of your fantasy world, and get into reality, dude, because the air smells much nicer out here than up your ass. The court date's on there. My name is on there as well as the police department. Please don't use your cell phone while operating your vehicle. This is not a if it's not a vehicle, then what is it? Is it your land yacht or a douche canoe or what is it? I mean, uh, inquiring minds want to know these things. I'm not operating a vehicle. I'm traveling. I'm not operating a vehicle for compensation. This is not. A, I'm traveling. Regardless of regardless of any anything you say. Stay true. I know you understand what I'm saying to you. It's conspiracy. All right. Have a good one. 
huh, conspiracy. Is it something you have actual evidence for, or is it something that you just pulled out of your ass to make you sound smart? I would wager the latter because, well, this whole video was pretty much stuff you were just pulling out of your ass. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will definitely see you on the next one.